Well, soon first responders suffering from PTSD will be able to file a workers' comp claim thanks to a change in Oklahoma law. As News 4's Austin Brissett found out, the change could give officers and firefighters time to heal after traumatic events. Oklahoma Fraternal Order of Police President Mark Nelson tells me this is six years in the making. Usually with workers' compensation, a physical injury is involved. But now for first responders, that doesn't have to be the case if PTSD is diagnosed. Uh, the things that we see and deal with on a, really on a daily basis have a profound effect. Not all injuries are visible. It's estimated one in three officers are impacted by post-traumatic stress disorder, and that's not adding in countless other first responders who may deal with it too. Now, a new law will allow first responders to file PTSD as a workers' compensation injury. It allows uh, our members to get treatment uh, generally uh, uh, consolidated into like a counseling or some type of medicine, and hopefully get them back on the job able to continue their career. There does have to be a diagnosis. If a first responder can't return to work, they can get temporary disability pay up to one year. If they're found to have a permanent disability, they can receive benefits up to $50,000. Nelson calling it a big step in eroding the PTSD stigma. Law enforcement's just been taught, you go out here, you deal with the job, all the horrific things that come from it, and it's really a tool that, that first responders have needed and deserve for quite some time. Austin Brissett, Oklahoma's News 4. And employers can be required to pay up to $10,000 for treatment of PTSD. It goes into effect in January of next year.